Welcome back to the channel, everybody. We've got a treat for you. We're gonna go get a Harley Davidson Road Glide. We're gonna go pick up a Harley, a Harley Davidson Road Glide. What year is it? <laughs> a 2016. Sweet, absolutely beautiful bike. And I'll uh, tell you what, I'll compare it against, I ride a 2013 F6B. And I'll do a comparison, tell you how it rides compared to a, to the F6B, which I honestly love. If I bought a Harley, it would be a road glide, probably like this one. Hey guys, good. Hello. What's your name? Come here. Come here, Angus. How are you doing, Angus? How are you doing? Oh. Hi. Hi, Angus. How you doing? This is a Magna? That's a Magna. 750 Magna. 750 Magna. Four, yeah, four stroke, four cylinder. Oh, thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. That's a kick. -a That's a, what year? Uh, I don't know. That's a what? What year is a it? A good year. Uh, 89? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's like 80. It's old. Oh, no, no, no. 98? Yeah, yeah. 98. It's, yeah, it's 98. Got a cell phone holder. Oh yeah, we put that on. So uh, Taylor said 25,000, 26,000, you should be concerned. It might not last much longer. What? Shit. There's nothing wrong this with This bike, huh? I bet you this That's bike a goes 100. Magna. I'm yeah. exactly, I was gonna say, I'd put my money on 100,000 miles. These no are the question. other things. Well, it's a four cylinder. It's a Honda. I mean, if you ride a motorcycle, four you have got to try yeah. that. I mean, look I mean, at that. God, that's a beautiful that, bike. That's like a, uh, it's like a 98, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe a 99. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is right about the same era as the Magdo. <laughs> I like Come, the flames. Tell me a little bit about this paint job. Oh, Keith did it. Keith, huh? It was the apple. But he did a custom over it with the brown, the root beer, and uh, did the candy. Candy apple? So yeah, this is a new bass boat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice bike right there. Oh hell yeah. So yeah. Does it have ABS too? Yes. And linked. Oh, they're linked to the back? Yeah, front to back on these. Bikes like, and he'll be selling that F6B. How is it compared to the F6B? So, honestly, this is really nice. All of you followers out there and subscribers, uh, talk to BG Rides. His bike's gonna be up for sale. It's gonna be going cheap. <laughs> uh, he, <laughs> he's gonna want a Harley now. We know that. <laughs> So this bike does have the Vance and Hines X pipe, the Vance and Hines fuel tuner, a Screaming Eagle intake, the Vance and Hines slip-ons. It's got a set of 12-inch mini apes on it, uh, but really that's about it. But it's set up. It's the last year of the 103, so he's loving it right now. <laughs> it was triple X, man. It was <laughs> fucking triple X, I'm telling you. Try not to think of those things, Brad. Yeah, we're not thinking oh about that. Oh my that was terrible. Oh, yeah. you know, okay, boy. You... BG rides. He's uh, he's Six getting two. his. Uh, I wish yeah. Was this is kind of like uh, twisted muscle, but oh, it yeah, isn't. Yes. There, Look you know, there's oh. there. There is some people out there that, you know, they have that comedy deal that just, how big a boy are you? I'm how big a boy are you? I'm a pretty big old boy, but well, I, I, I give up my fighting from the Vietnam days. Come over there and whoop that ass. <laughs> so that's what Brad's just ma matching him up here, just see how he is. How do you start it? Uh, right here. Oh, you have sure to clutch, clutch him? It. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Hey, have fun. See you, buddy.
Oh, this bike feels really good. I gotta say, I could get used to riding something like this. The reach is a little far for me. Feels like it'll handle really nice. Having the grips up a little higher feels so damn nice. That's the one drawback of the F6B. <laughs> I killed it. <laughs> you know, the fairing, honestly, for being as short as it is, you know, the F6B's got a lot higher windshield, but this guy feels really nice, honestly. I would probably say the suspension's a little bit, a little bit rougher on this than the F6B. And we have a, another seat we're gonna throw on this bike too. This one's just cool as hell looking, but it's not the most comfortable. And if this bike goes on a long ride, you gotta have a comfy, comfy seat. You come to a stop and you can feel the bike vibrating, which is actually kind of cool. It makes you feel like you're really riding. Like you're really riding something. The F6B, its engine is so damn smooth. But this honestly feels really, really nice. It's like you feel like you're part of the bike or something, you know? Oh yeah, that 103 feels good. Right here, we're going about, what, 70? And there's like zero helmet buffeting, which I would have thought with a smaller fairing, you might pick up a little bit, but honestly, it's just awesome. And I don't want to make it sound like, you know, I'm just saying a bunch of nice stuff for the Harley, but the, the smaller windshield actually does pretty damn good. I always thought that the small windshield on a, on a Harley didn't really block much wind, but I think the way it deflects it up over your head, like I can feel the air up here, but right here in front of me, you don't feel anything. But up about this high, you can feel it, which is perfect. I guess if I had to, I might pick up slightly, just ever so slightly taller windshield, but it feels really good. And the foot forward or the forward controls is a very comfortable position. It's kind of like you're sitting in a couch lounger. F6B is a little bit more of a bar stool. I got to tell you, if you guys are thinking about getting a bike, If you're thinking about getting a bike for this summer doing some nice uh you know touring kind of riding this is an awesome bike if you were looking at this if you were looking at an f6b both bikes would you would have an absolute blast anyway i've got to say that this bike it's got a little bit more character in it a little bit rougher a little bit tougher you got to work a little bit more, which is fun. F6B, it's almost like that bad boy goes into autopilot. Shit, it drives itself. I'd have to say too, the info station there, right up front, easy to see. All the gauges are easy to see. You don't have to look down. You know, you don't have to like go like this to look at your speedometer or something very comfortable bike just like the f6b 
but this would be a blast to take on a trip this bike is so smooth I would trade you if you want to take this. <laughs> it's very comfy. And it looks nice. Oh my god. Yeah, no, it's a nice bike. I like the uh, forward foot controls. Oh yeah. Little canyon, canyon road here. Super fun. the last year the 103 was in in production if you guys are wondering like does the 103 have enough you know you hear all the hype about the bigger bigger more powerful engines 103 is it feels awesome now how does it compare to the f6b if you're wondering no, I'd say the F6B's got an edge for sure. But uh, this has got plenty of power. You know, if you're if you're interested in performance bike, kind of like racing, sure, the 103 might not have enough, but big deal. So what? You're riding for the style, for the fun, for the pleasure, for the for the experience is what you're taking this bad boy out for. Look at that gas, it's already 339. My overall impression is extremely hot. You can't go wrong with a nice bike like this. If you're into touring, you cannot go wrong. In a heartbeat, I'd take this. You know, would I rather have this than my F6B? Probably not, not right now. I mean, I'm just so used to the F6B. But would I switch off and on during the ride? Oh my God, yeah. It would be an absolute blast. If you're thinking about, should I get a, a road glide? The road glide's got a little bit more room. You feel like you have more room compared to a street glide. Uh, handlebar position up a little higher is very comfortable if you're wondering if it is it is just that's it it's just very very comfy you can't can't say enough about that Guys, thank you very much for coming along for the ride. It's been really fun. Gorgeous bike. Love it. Big Daddy said, hey, you want to come out and get that, uh, you know, get that Harley with me? And I was like, oh, hell yeah, I'd love to get on that bike. So it's been a blast. It's been a treat. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next ride. There we go. Kind of narrow. It's like I'm magical. I'm just trying to will that garage door open. Open sesame. Wait, open sesame? Maybe open sesame. Yep, work. Okay, just gotta say it a little faster. Man, I'd love to have, I would love to have one of these and an F6B. God, that would be the, that would be the ticket. <laughs>